It's your boy D Jackie Demix, and we all know that Shirek Five Star Goons are in heated competition for the most senseless crimes committed in what has been now known to be the Coon Olympics. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, Chirac, the place where it's easier to catch a bullet than a cold. Now, after Easter weekend in Chirac, where reportedly over 40 niggas got shot, 9 niggas got killed, and children young as 11 years old were catching lead bullets and being peeled off the pavement by the coroner, it was announced that the feds were going to do an intervention in the war in Chirac, to really get a handle on all the slugs flying around freely within the city. But of course, not to be outdone, Chirac finest five-star goons were determined to continue the war zone and the fuckery. And they loved the war zone-like atmosphere they had. So what did they do? They stepped that shit up. They increased their nigga shot per hour statistic immensely it was reported that just last night in the span of seven hours we had eight niggas that got shot it's clear that these armed shirak goons are in rare form and reportedly the hours of operation for these armed shirak insurgents were from 1 p.m to 8 p.m which just shows me that nighttime shooting is out of here shoot niggas at midnight or when they're sleeping that's completely old school no more shooting in the dark or in conditions with low visibility. Obviously, broad daylight shooting is what's in. I mean, goddamn, I guess when these Negroes say they want you to see them while they're rolling up on you and gonna shoot you, they really mean it. Now, it seems that the Chirac goons also have finally put an end to age discrimination. They have opened up their killing spree on all goddamn ages. Reportedly, out of the eight people shot in the seven-hour span... The age range was from 14 all the way to 56. I mean, goddamn, at this point, if you aren't sleeping in Southside Chirac with a Kevlar vest, you're probably an idiot. And to make matters worse, federal lawmakers are frustrated as hell with Chicago local lawmakers, who, when they suggested stricter gun penalties and also less gun permits, Chicago officials says, fuck that. They increased the amount of weapons they gave out. Now, apparently, Chicago is the city where the most illegal weapons are currently at and currently get transferred through. Now, I don't know what the National Guard is doing. I don't know what the fuck the military is doing abroad looking for planes that we don't even know if got ate by sharks. But we need some real military presence in Chirac. These niggas is popping off like it's nothing. There's more niggas getting shot more than they are getting baptized in Chicago. I proposed last time we need to have a mass prayer meeting. These Negroes need Jesus. And we need to start baptizing all the chief keeps and all niggas like him in holy water. But once again, this is just your boy DJ Academics. I'm just bringing you the news. Hit that like button. Make sure you comment, share. What do you think about the fucker and the senseless crime that continues in Chicago? As I said before, when the fuck will they run out of niggas to shoot? I mean, even McDonald's runs out of hamburgers every once in a while. Come on. But I don't know. I'm out.